He's got to pledge allegiance to New Zealand. And the second thing is this. You're a law, if you're a lawmaker, you ought to obey the law. And that's what you're doing. The interesting thing is that actually I don't think Honey really does object to the oath. I'll predict that, he'll, that he will uh, uh, swear it. I think August the 2nd. August the 2nd. It was a stunt. What, a, what annoys me as a taxpayer is why are we paying his wages, 140000 plus expenses worth another 100000 and he hasn't even turned up to work yet. He managed to... <laughs> You've got 30 seconds. You've got 30, you've got 30 seconds for your I've been thinking, your summary, summary of what you've been thinking this week. Oh, what I've been thinking about? Oh, well, I'm, I'm uh, opposed to uh, capital gains tax. If you could tax your way to prosperity, the Soviet Union would have won the Cold War. And the second thing I say to people who are in favour of taxes, look, they're like acorns, they grow. When the Labour Party bought in GSC, it was 10%. It was never going to be increased. It's now 15%. And when income tax was introduced, all the politicians said that that was only going to be on the wealthy, and of course it's now on all of us. You have capital gains tax, and it'll be on your family home, I'm telling you. All right.